Hello survivors, welcome back. It's been a while since I did a video. Um, with everything going on, I just didn't feel like it was appropriate to be doing videos. It's just been so much going on in the world today. I just had to take a little break. But today I had something that I wanted to discuss with you guys. I wanted to talk about a vitamin called quercetin. Quercetin is a flavonoid plant pigment. It is an antioxidant that has anti-cancer, anti-inflammatory, antiviral properties. It is naturally found in foods and vegetables such as red wine, red onions, red apples, green tea, berries, and kale. It is a wonderful naturally occurring compound that provides many health benefits. So let's talk about it. <music> So today we're going to talk about at least 10 benefits of quercetin. Quercetin is an anti-inflammatory. Inflammation is something that everyone experiences and it happens when the body attempts to protect itself from harmful stimuli. However, chronic inflammation can lead to different conditions, which can include cancers, heart disease, rheumatoid arthritis. Though further research is currently being done, Quercetin is thought to lower inflammation in inflammatory diseases like IBS because of its antioxidant properties. Number two, quercetin is a pain fighter. Because of the anti-inflammatory efforts of quercetin, painful conditions can be minimized. Autoimmune conditions such as arthritis, painful infections such as prostate, respiratory infections can benefit from quercetin. If you're having pain in your joints, if you're having a hard time with pain in any area, it can be very effective. Number three, quercetin is a natural antihistamine. Histamines are chemicals in your body that your immune system makes, and they help your body to get rid of an allergen. In order to get rid of the allergen, the histamine causes you to sneeze or cough, have watery eyes or a runny nose, and feel itchy because it wants those allergens out of your body. The abnormal release of histamines can negatively impact your respiratory system, leading to multiple health complications, such as redness, irritation, swelling. Being loaded with antihistamines Quercetin can help with these respiratory problems. It influences intracellular enzymes and reduces excessive histamine excretions. So if you have any problems with allergies, take quercetin. It will be so helpful. Number four, quercetin helps asthma. Quercetin functions as a bronchodilator, a drug that opens the airway of the lungs and reduces the amount of inflammation or allergic reaction chemicals in the body. Therefore, quercetin can reduce the sovereignty of asthma attacks that react to chemicals. Number five, quercetin has cardiovascular health benefits. Studies have shown that the consumption of flavonoids specifically quercetin, promotes overall cardiovascular health. First, it encourages blood flow. Secondly, researchers have observed that quercetin's antioxidant action protects against LDL cholesterol. LDL is a bad cholesterol. This may be beneficial because oxidation causes LDL cholesterol to stick to artery walls. Too much LDL cholesterol could cause osteoporosis heart attacks and strokes, and we do not want that. Number six, balanced blood pressure. Along with supporting cardiovascular health, quercetin naturally promotes balanced blood pressure. A double-blind placebo-controlled crossover study evaluated the effect of quercetin supplement and reported that the participants expressed a stabilization in systolic and diastolic in average arterial pressure. Number seven, anti-cancer. 
quercetin. It's an anti-cancer powerhouse. So if you have cancer, if you know someone with cancer, you definitely want to be taking quercetin. Quercetin, like other flavonoids, seek out to free radicals in the body and neutralize them before they can damage the bodily systems. Therefore, it becomes a potential in being an anti-cancer agent. Quercetin has been connected to a reduction in pancreatic, prostate, colorectal, breast cancer, and skin cancers. And all those studies are ongoing signs are pointing toward number eight, protects against stress. Who wants stress? None of us want stress. So anything you can take to help with your stress, we want to do that, right? Right. So when your body is stressed, it produces cortisol. Cortisol is a hormone that produces that fight or flight response. Although this is normal when your stress levels are high and ongoing, cortisol can damage muscle tissue leading to protein breakdown in the body. Quercetin can fight these efforts during times of extended stress as it suppresses the enzyme necessary for cortisol release. Number nine, promotes healthy skin. Who doesn't want healthy looking skin and glowing skin? Quercetin, according to dietitians, eating quercetin filled diet with lots of colorful veggies and fruits can contribute to youthful looking skin. It nourishes your skin naturally and enhances your complexion as well. Being an antioxidant, quercetin has ability to fight factors that promote early aging. Number 10 is this also can be great for prevention of viruses. So like the coronavirus, quercetin is antiviral. So that means that you can also add it to your regimen of supporting your immune system to prevent you from getting the coronavirus. I'm not saying it's a coronavirus cure, but it also can really help with building your immune system. So you wanna add quercetin to your regimen for that reason. So I wanted to show you guys the quercetin that I take. Um, quercetin by Natural Bell. But you can take any quercetin brand that you want. This one even says that it's anti-inflammatory, supports cardiovascular health. It has 240 capsules in it. Um, each one is 500 milligrams. I take two at a time, so that makes 1,000 milligrams. Um, you're going to take it three times a day. So it says that it's soy-free, gluten-free, dairy-free, GMO-free. You can take it with or without food. Um, yeah, I would definitely would recommend taking quercetin. Quercetin is an anti-cancer powerhouse. So you definitely want to add it to your regimen. This is the reason why I take it. If you guys are still here, you should subscribe to my page like my page, like my channel. Thank you guys for being here and supporting me. Watch some of my other videos. Tell me what you think about it. I'm gonna put some up here. Choose one. Have a great day.